I'm Melissa Becker with Razor Vision Productions, and today we're catching up with Coach Hale to see what's happening with soccer this season. How has off-season been? It, it was good. You know, in the spring, we had a great spring. We played seven games, we went 3-1-3. One, and three. Uh, We had a good fall, but it was just a chance to continue kind of imprinting what we're trying to do from a defensive uh, attacking and even a cultural standpoint. Uh, it was excellent. You know, we can't be around the girls in the, the summer program, Summer B. Participation's excellent. Uh, I think last year we had four or five. This year we have about 23. Uh, so we're excited. What key players are you counting on to make a difference this year? You know, I mean, you never know who's going to stand up. We kind of just take this approach that it's going to be the, the whole of the parts is bigger than the sum. Um, you know, so I don't know that this is a team that really has a ton of individual stars. I think it's just a group that's going to show up, uh, be a very, very good team, um, work hard, and, and try to attain some good results. Okay. And last year you had a lot of great successes with everything you did. And what are your expectations to keep up momentum again for this season? You know, it's a, it's a great group of girls. Um, I think the culture is much better than this time last year. Uh, we have way more answers to some questions than we did. But going into any fall, I mean, there's always players that will need to step up, play a different role, a bigger role. Um, and so we just the expectations are going to be that the culture gets better, um, that the girls work hard, and that we compete. You know, I think that we have a chance to be pretty good. Um, but obviously, that's something we have to show on the field. And then your first game is an exhibition match coming up against Creighton in Omaha. Is there anything that you're expecting or wanting to do in your first game to get some momentum for the rest of the season? Yeah, I mean, it's a game we'll probably play everyone, uh, most people, um, and we'll, it'll be a chance to kind of tinker. You know, in preseason, you'll play yourself um, and you'll work on some things, but until you try against somebody else, I um, mean, have a whole group, I think we have 11 freshmen coming in, it'll be their opportunity to kind of show um, where they're at in uh, preparation for actual game time. Um, but overall, yeah, we'll just use it. We'll play, we'll probably play 330s, you know, uh, something along that. It'll be a little bit of an untraditional uh, format. And we'll put the, the kids in some situations and see how they respond. And you do have a lot of freshmen and young players on the team. What are you doing to help get them ready to play for the game? I mean, that's always a little bit of a mixed bag. They're here for Summer B, so they're here working out with the strength coach. I think they're doing some pickups some things like that. Hopefully get them acclimated, taking some classes, getting adjusted to, to regular life on campus. Um, but overall, I mean, we won't really know until they play in a game that matters. We see how they react to the crowd and the, and the, the stress of the SEC. And then how are you enjoying being a Razorback soccer coach? I mean, this place is this place is unbelievable. We love the town. We love the facilities. We love the fans. I mean, this is the best fans in the country. Um, you know, administration. There's really no part about it we don't love. The sky is definitely the ceiling. Uh, we know it's a process in terms of building the program. We're pleased with the steps we've taken, and we're really excited for the future. And we've caught up with Coach Kobe Hale, and we'll see you again this upcoming soccer season.